My neighborhood on edge after a doorbell camera captured a suspicious man peeking into homes. Police say he was seen lurking at at least two different properties on separate occasions. And as Zania Maldonado explains, he's now under arrest thanks to the brave resident who confronted him. A man wanted for following a woman home earlier this week here in Brookline is now in police custody after another neighbor caught the suspect in his garage Thursday morning. <laughs> Michael Samuel says he caught this man in the red shirt entering his backyard just before 10 a.m. Thursday. He was either extremely lost, confused, or up to no good. What are you looking for? Samuels then confronts a suspect. At that point, I started to ask him if he was looking for something. He couldn't answer, um, so I followed him, and I just got to the end of the street, and that's when I called the police. He leaves, but in a matter of minutes, he's back, this time in front of the Lawrence Road home, before Samuels tells him to leave again. Even after I'd, I'd confronted him, he, was, he, he wasn't speaking clearly, didn't, didn't have... Um, couldn't really give a, an answer as to what he was looking for or why he was even around here. Police say they were able to locate and arrest the man, 48-year-old Miguel Martinez, and they soon realized he was also wanted for an incident that took place on Monday. My young woman reported that she was walking to her residence uh, where she was employed as a nanny uh, for the family that lived there, and she was followed home by a man that she didn't recognize. Police say the woman locked the door behind her, but Martinez is seen peering into the home on Chatham Street and trying to open the door. She turned and noticed that he was on the property, asked him if he needed anything. He muttered something, and she went into the house and called um, the mother. In both incidents, no items were stolen and no one was harmed. The suspect was charged with two counts of breaking and entering with intent to commit a felony. In Brookline, Sania Maldonado, WBZ News.